to have your attention. I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. To the AAA MF YouTube channel. Today we have a guest presenter, Mr. Paul Woodman. From you just said Love. <laughs> talk about the cars. I didn't know I was presenting. So thank you, Mark. Thank you. Lovecars.com. See the link. You've had some pretty cool videos recently. GT2 RS against the Lamborghini Aventador. An Aventador S, which Aventador is pretty S. good. Yeah. yeah. How nice. was that? It was a lot of fun. There was beautiful scenery, nice and switched. Switzerland, Switzerland right? Yeah. Amazing. Not quite as good as this. This is one hell of a lineup you've got well, here, Well, we, uh, we're trying to compete with you here, so we've brought <laughs> along a spectacular array of cars today. You have. Everyone loves to see drag races, so we've got together a few friends, and we've come to this lovely private airstrip, and we are going to do some drag races. So what we're going to do, we're going to go and look at each car, okay. talk about it, and um, maybe have a guess at which one's going to be fastest and which one's more enjoyable to drive and more desirable. Sounds good. So let's start off with, and let's introduce George. <laughs> Shake the camera. <laughs> yeah, I'm here, yeah. <laughs> we, and we're going to start off with the uh, 911 Turbo. Not many things are actually faster than a Turbo S because it's got the four wheel drive, mm. twin turbo, 3.8 litre, twin turbo engine. So not many things can compete with this. Is it fun to drive though? Because it's got four wheel drive. Is it, as, fun? Just is, it as fun as, is, is it as fun as this? GT3 991.2. That's a different animal, isn't it? Now we've got this one has a manual gearbox. This is, I would say, one of the best driver's cars on the road at the moment. Yeah, I agree with you. But this falls down in the power. This is only 507 brake horsepower, I think, this one. And getting off the line is going to be some struggle. Manual gearbox and that not so much power as well. Yeah, but we'll this see. is very enjoyable. Very different cars, both great. This is Joseph's car, this is Duncan's car. We're gonna put all their links on the... And now we have the oh, star, now you're talking. Now the you're star, talking. Performante Spider. What's the color, Mark? Blue. <laughs> <laughs> Does George know? Uh, I think it's Verde Urancis. So this is, or... uh, if, you, if you come around here and have a look inside the car, this is the color of the car, okay? And the guy has been very clever and put a lovely matte PPF on the car. So it gives it that lovely matte finish. Looks amazing. What a you obviously have car. to go for the comfort seats in these cars because the, um, the bucket seats are very uncomfortable, um, even if you're slim like me. <laughs> and it's got the bronze uh, wheels. What do you think of these? Have you driven one yet? Not the Peppermint Seas, by the way. No. So um, I think this is one of the, the best looking cars in the world. I think to get a better looking car than that, you've got to go Pagani, Zonda or something. You've got to spend a lot more money, I think. Yeah. That's for sure. It's beautiful. A few more zeros to the price tag. A few more. And this one, sponsored by BA, British Airways, I think, um, <laughs> is in a beautiful, beautiful, I don't think you can see the fleck in this color. Um, George will get to see this fleck in this color. Don't worry about that. Yeah, George is going to get it on camera. Yeah, I'll get it. Don't worry. So this is a, uh, again, four wheel drive. Both of the Lambos are four wheel drive, naturally aspirated V10. This has 640 brake horsepower. This one has 610. So it's called the LP610-4. We did a video on this before, actually. Love the color, love the car. What's it like to drive? Fun. Fun. Great dual People, clutch gearbox. Well, you'll, you'll say it's boring because it's four wheel drive, but I, I think it's fun. Lots of drive. I would say I but the four wheel drive drive the four wheel <laughs> drivetrain in this has got to be different to the Porsche, right? I reckon this is more real wheel drive bias it than is. the Porsche. And you get a lot more drama in this than you do in yeah, the Porsche. Of course, and, sure. and the roof down makes a huge difference. Yeah. Uh, now we come to the um, cheapest one of the range. <laughs> yeah. I'm not That's sure. The I'm, not sure. At the moment. I'm not sure what the Porsche is worth. Anyway, but my McLaren 650S, you've obviously seen this in some other videos, rear wheel drive, 3.8 litre V10, uh, V8, twin turbo, 641 brake horsepower. So same power as the Performante, but that does it with a V10 naturally aspirated engine. 
very, very quick. Mm. I mean, once this gets going, not much can keep up with it. Great looking car as well. Really good looking car. And I, the thing I love about this car that none of the other cars have Hydro doors. Wings up Wednesday. Absolutely. Very so you good. need this car if you want to have an Instagram account. If you have to do wings up Wednesday. <laughs> Hashtag wings up. And as thing is we're as an air, we're an airstrip, this kind of makes sense. I mean look at this car. When you have both the doors open. Get a shot from here, George. Look at this. Come on, George. Look at that. Beautiful, right? I mean, it's a great great look. McLaren are building some beautiful looking cars at the moment. It's a it's a wonderful car. Very fast car at the moment as well. And then the last car we have today, Ben's car, the Ferrari FF. So, 300 new and 150 second hand. Is it a bargain at 150? Oh, I love the FF. I think it's a great car. Let's driven one? Driven one? Yeah, many miles, many miles. And the GC4 C Luso as well. So. so, I've driven this car at the Evo Triangle. We went there a few weeks ago. Um, it didn't feel as planted as I thought it would, being a four wheel drive. It feels quite loose. I Did like you find that? Well, you're much more of a driver, Mark. I'm, I can only aspire to be a you're driver. You're more of a presenter. <laughs> well, yeah. Does everyone know your name? No. Chicken Nugget. Uh, yeah, exactly. Chicken Nugget. <laughs> okay, so we've got the V12 engine. This is pumping out 680 brake horsepower and four-wheel drive. So, what's going to win the drag race? I've got no idea. I, if, I really if, don't know. If you're a betting man... If I was a betting man, I would say that the 911 Turbo S four-wheel drive is going to be on par with the Ferrari FF. Oh. This, don't overlook this, this is going to be a very fast car. Once it gets going off the line, this is going to be a very fast car. The thing with the McLaren is, because we've done a drag race before, I, I did a video with the uh, GT3 RS 4 litre and a Speciale, and then I brought in the McLaren at the end. This doesn't get off the line very quickly because it's rear-wheel drive, but once it gets the grip, it's, it's, it flies. But I think that the Porsche with the four-wheel drive will get off the line really quickly. The um, the Performante is a contender, but my money's going to be on the 911 Turbo and the FF. The power and the grip of the 911 Turbo. You can only choose one. Which one are you going to choose? And I'll, I'll let you my, let you into my secret which one's going to win. I'm going to go for 911 Turbo. Well, i got to go with the FF, the big V12, the V12. raw power and the four-wheel drive. George, what are you going with? I'm going 911 Turbo just because it's lighter than the FF, even though the FF's more powerful. And I think we know more about cars than Paul. Oh, by then. Yeah. No yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
one, which was my bet all along. You weren't wrong. I should have got my head and not my heart. However, it was a great video. Thank you for joining us. I hope you enjoyed watching. Please subscribe for more videos to come. Very good. Thank you for inviting me, Mark. I enjoyed it. We'll see so we now have a little bonus for you on this video. What we've got now is a Tesla P100D, which Paul has brought along. And what we're going to do is we're going to race it against the 911. Now, funny enough, these cars are worth about the same money. This is worth 110,000 new, and this is 118,000 new. Obviously, this is a very different manual flat six gearbox versus an electric car. But I think it's going to be interesting. Let's see if Paul is confident. Of course, I'm confident. Yes, of course right, guys, you're confident. <laughs> Who do you think is going to win? There's only one winner. There's only one winner. Chicken nuggets. <laughs> The Tesla one. Why don't we go and see the reactions from the drivers? Guys? What happened? We need to go again. What happened? Yeah, There's no more know. chances. What did I tell you? <laughs> winners are grinners. <laughs> did it look fast? Yeah, this took off. This took off. It's just so relaxed. So relaxed. One hand, just enjoying a bit of music. You won something for once. First time in my life. <laughs> race two with a Tesla. You won the first race. Now you're racing a Ferrari FF with a V12 engine. Oh, I'm shivering. <laughs> you think you're going to win? Of course it's going to win. The Tesla's not going to lose to that, is it? Okay, let's go. Ready, guys? Let's hear your exhaust, Paul. Okay, ready? Good to go. One, two, go! <laughs> and Ferraris buy a Tesla P100D. You've got a new name. What's that? I dread to think. The Porsche Slayer. <laughs> Ferrari <laughs> Slayer, Supercar Slayer. I have to say, I've never been so relaxed doing a drag race in my whole life. It's, it, it was just a pleasure. So, Everyone should sell their supercar and get a Tesla. No, that's not what I'm saying, but this is a very good addition to your supercar family. It's wonderful, isn't it? Yeah, it's very wonderful. Very cool. Did you get that exhilaration when you were driving, though? Well, you get the exhilaration when you look in rear view mirror and you see a V12 Ferrari behind you, which is uh, quite exhilarating. But other than that, it doesn't really fill you with the same emotion as the Ferrari. Would you buy one? Oh, absolutely. Have you bought one? That's confidential. No, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for today guys I, 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 I